Okay, it's been a while. So let's get back into the Nuzlocke. We are almost done. We have exactly two more badges left. And after that, we are gonna fight Red. Honestly, I don't, I don't know if I wanna go through the trouble of trying to level everyone up. I think if I can get everyone to at least level 60, then that'll be good enough. I say that, but I, I know his highest level, shit, his lowest level Pokemon is level 80, so I'm gonna be at a 20 level disadvantage, so it's basically gonna come down to strategy, which, you know, I'm ready to do, but <sighs> that'd be annoying. Anyway, uh, let's uh, first get to, uh, what's it called? Did I? All right, it's been a while since I uh, recorded, so I don't remember. Did I catch Suicune already? Yeah. Okay. I actually caught a lot more Pokemon than I thought I would, but then again, it's uh, two uh, regions, so I guess that would yield a lot of uh, a lot of Pokemon because there's a lot of routes. Not gonna honestly use Diglett. Okay. <sighs> I don't know what's in this mountain. Uh, why am I even going over here again? Okay, because there was some stuff on Route 4. I forgot. Fucking Adios was here. Okay. Uh, I wanted to get to Route 4, because there is some stuff over there. Mount Moon. Oh! I really thought I was done with you, to be honest. I kind of like his progression. <laughs> He's like, I know you're strong, but I can't help but want to fight you. It's kind of a bad matchup to start off for me, actually. Uh, I could try Sleep Powder, but it's definitely going to Ice Shard, so... It's definitely would have Ice Sharded, because that's the best move to do right there. Shadow Claw. What? You're an Ice type. I was a... I was a Grass type. What is... What are you doing? I can honestly take you down, but, oh yeah, that's right, uh, saps up in the box because I had Nate out. Hmm. I do have Water Absorb, right? I do. Alright, we're good. <clears throat> While training with Angie not training, but while grounded with Angie, uh, my lantern, I made a mistake of thinking she was uh, Volts Absorbed and she almost died, so I gotta keep reminding myself to check before. Uh, you're pure water type, so technically Ice Beam should be. Oh, you had the same idea. I feel like mine's a freeze? I doubt you have water absorb. Actually not in a good spot. Uh you know what? I'm 
not survive another hit. Uh, definitely won't survive a crit. I mean, if you're gonna do slash. Oh, faster. Okay. Damn. Okay. I mean, if a super effective move wasn't that damaging, I don't know why you considered Slash wouldn't... Eh, he's asleep. I'll just use this chance. Eh, he'll probably need a Moo Moo Milk. Do I have potions? I should have potions. Yeah, okay. Actually, he needs 40. Uh, do I want to use a... Uh, I guess I should. Yeah, I kind of wish I had Giga Drain, but yeah, it's whatever. Uh huh. Trying to raise my stats. Even a crit wouldn't be a deal. Come on, raise my stats. Could no pursuit. Mm. I think a lemonade would probably be best here. Eh, nah, I might as well. Just to be safe. But I think lemonade gave me 90, so I wouldn't be in super danger, but I don't know. He might be re ready to crit. I think that's special, which his special defense isn't that high. Excuse me, her special defense. They did an even 50, so I already know exactly what a crit is, and we survived. Why would you start a... I guess that's a smart move. I would just instantly went with a thunder, a thunderbolt. Let's go. Four times effective. Nice. Let's 
sort of concerning. Because I'm poison type, so. Uh, I don't have Onyx because he's like so over. Like he's so overpowered from that, uh. From that, uh, action replay code I used. I didn't want to bring him back out. Uh. Gabriel should be fine. And I have Silver Wind, so that should be effective against Psychic types. Why would you choose to save? There's no, there's no way you have the same type. Of move. I mean, you could have had extra sensory, but there was no way you had the same move as a Neo. Move. Like this AI is just really dumb, man. <coughs> All right, let's see. Is Bug type super effective against Poison? Not Poison, Psychic. It is. Okay. Hey, let's go. Defeating the Alakazam with a psychic type move. Is there anything more disrespectful? Okay. Gengar. It's just a slack off. Ah. Oh. I came here to beat people. Alright, so here's the thing. I still don't... After all my time playing Pokemon, I still don't fully understand how ghost typing works. Like, I know it's effective against Psychic and other ghosts, but, like, is that also, like, vice versa? I don't think Psychic is super effective against ghosts, right? I don't think. Uh... Ghost can. Okay. The way I, I guess the way I should think about it, just looking at the typing chart. The way I should think about it is a ghost. A ghost can hurt another ghost. Like a ghost can hit another ghost. And seeing ghosts messes with your mind. But the fear of ghosts. And the fear of the dark outweighs that, I guess. I guess. But basically, bug type won't be super effective. Psychic type won't be super effective. But also, I'm normal because we haven't introduced fairy yet. So this is literally the best matchup for me. Oh wait, and Gengar is poison. No, so actually, psychic is super effective. I just did all that for nothing. <clears throat> See, that's why I had that's why I had such a hard time understanding ghost types was because I keep forgetting that Gengar is poison and ghost. Okay, it froze for a second there. That's concerning. For a second, I thought he said, see it there. I was about to be like, no. Oh, cool. Last time she wanted to battle, she just wanted to talk about her Pokemon. Can I even get anything in here? That's it, no. Let's go ahead and speed this up. Oh, shit, right. I need to go heal. Not only that, but I need to get my, uh... Well, I need Rock Smash and Strength. I hope not. Or some time to shine. Throw all that training to be, you know, kind of bittersweet if she never came to fight. Uh, let's see. Sixty-two. Jesus Christ. Okay. 
I think that's good coverage. Let's go ahead and heal. Let's go into this cave. Mount Moon. What's that sound familiar? Okay, realistically, hold on. Let me actually look up Mount Moon because if I have nothing I can catch in here, uh, then I just should just hit a full repel so I can get out of here. Um, where is it? Mount Moon? Okay. I can get I can get stuff here. Paris and Clefairy, basically. Uh, we got a second floor. We got a square. Okay. That was like a surfing area. Well, I got everything in that square. Uh, yeah, it's really just uh, Clefairy and Paris, which I don't need. In all honesty, so you know, I'm just, I can just pop a repel. Their <laughs> their level is severely low enough to where repel is really all I'm gonna need. Wrong place. Oh shit! Did I grow berries? I can't even remember. Oh god, I did. Thank God they're alive. How are you still? How are you still alive? Jesus. Okay. Uh, where's my repels? There they are. Okay. Uh oh. Okay. Well. Uh, let's go explore and see if there's anything to find. Why did I miss that? Great, nice. <laughs> All right, so this is Route Four. What is up here? Looks like something's supposed to be up there. Hello. Is my Pokemon want to battle me? I mean, it's, it's always for. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh. See, I was really about to say, so why we have such low-level fighters out here? Not fighters, trainers out here. But, oh uh, no, it was a ruse. I mean, that Pidgey was, like, accurate to his level. You know, a Pidgey should be low level. If he had, like, a level 30 Pidgey, I would have looked at him funny, so. Like, so many people who have Pokemon that damn should have evolved already, but they had them in higher levels. I mean, I guess I'm one to talk, because I literally kept one of my Pokemon from evolving until... 
he could use like a certain move and then then I let him evolve so you know I guess I'm uh, not one to criticize in this scenario but still <coughs> I've seen a furt. I swear, this is the first time we've actually seen a furt. I don't think anyone's used it in, uh, this whole time. I'd be willing to say we live this. I increase Rapunzel's special and physical defense. So unless that's a crit, yeah. I was gonna say unless it's a crit, we survive this. <laughs> Which is kind of why I'm like on the fence on whether I really need to get all the way up to level 80 to fight Red. I know she was cute. <coughs> HP up, okay. But yeah, that's kind of why I'm just like, do I really need to like go level up to fight Red? Because at this point, I've EV trained all of my Pokemon to pretty much a desirable uh, stat range. They're not perfect, mind you, but I mean, you know, they don't need to be. I got them as high as I could and the range that I wanted them to be, so no regrets. Sure. <gasps> Ooh. I can finally buy them in bulk. You know have you have no idea how annoying it is to get that shit from the vending machine. I wish they had more vendors that let you do this, man. I have so much money. Good God. I'm probably sharing too much, but y'all ever have the problem where you have so much money in the game or in like a video game and then you look at real life and you're just like, why don't I have that much money? I have that problem. I'm pretty sure other people have that problem too. I had three nuggets and I didn't sell them. I have even more money now. <laughs> I know I just bought a lot of shit. I was about to say, I bought a lot of shit and I have a lot of money, but I'm still checking in that trash can. Let me guess, this is where the, uh, other letter is. Yep. Alright. Uh, yes, I'm a dumbass. So it was literally just for this. It's kind of cute, actually. Or kind of neat, I should say. Um, but yeah, there's like nothing in that square, is there? No, just poly, uh, polywag and magic heart. Highest I can get is like a level forty polywag, which I mean I would definitely love to get flaps back, but you know, rest in peace. <clears throat> I only could make the exception uh, for Gwanda because I didn't evolve Geodude. So. Well, actually, no, I had to make the exception because I caught him thinking that it was, like, necessary for me to do the Safari Zone, which, in all honesty, it was completely optional. 
So now I'm just at the crossroad of like, I guess I'll keep you, but I won't really, like, it's the most pointless shit, because like, I've decided to keep Wanda, but I decided also not to use her in any, you know, important battle. So yeah, I might as well have just thrown her back, but I don't know, I guess I leveled her up out of guilt for not being able to get Golem, you know? Um, yeah. Who the fuck is Kyler? <laughs> that man said, I'd rather fight. I'd rather get my ass beat than keep fishing. You know what, bro? I'm here for you. Alright, there's really uh, nothing here. choose that so I think we had to go through Viridian City get to Palatown then we can get the Cinnabar then the Seafoam Islands uh, where is uh, Blaine is in the Seafoam Islands so yeah To my knowledge, Blaine should be weaker than Blue. Alright, so let's... Uh, I was going to say fast travel. It's kind of fast travel.
Is there anything I can catch over here? What route is this even? 22. Uh, let's see, is there anything worth catching over here? the best <sighs> yeah at the best it'd be ponytail other than that not really hmm also he said he was going back to the dragons then in order to train this Pokemon ironically there's really not high level Pokemon over there so I don't know why he's going there <laughs> But alright, I just wanted to go over there so I could unlock the uh, plateau from this side. Now, hopefully I don't fucking have to deal with cut anymore. Definitely not going to need it on Cinnabar or Seafoam Island. Alright, so let's head down from Pallet Town, or excuse me, head down to Pallet Town. Anything to say? Okay. Oh, hello. Oh god. It's like eyes are staring into my soul. I don't like it. Okay. Fix that. School kid. Yep. Oh, now we're running into ferrets. <clears throat> Probably gonna do sixty damage. Not even. Damn. Should I increase the PP of that? I probably should, right? I probably should. It's gonna be valuable. Plus, I don't really have any other moves I truly want to increase the PP for. I don't want eight. Just want seven. That's probably about as much as I'll ever use. Dun 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 dun. dun. All right, Danny, let's see what you got. Okay.
this kid had a uh, very interesting Pokemon selection. That's the photography. Hello. You an ace trainer? Yep. French. to see exactly how strong an Alakazam is. A crit would actually kill me there. He knows not the darkness he's about to partake. Also, I have not been checking. Uh, we're kind of going to where each other is. I mean, even if I didn't, you still fight me, so... Hey, it's my favorite. I'll probably do like half. Honestly, a crit would have killed me there. Alright, I guess I should stop playing around with that. Alright. I just didn't know Ivysaur lowered my Sludge Bomb in 47. Probably because I don't have an Ivysaur with Sludge Bomb. Because my Ivysaur would have evolved by now. Gabriel's fine. Just make a wish. I don't think the wish... Does the wish kill status effects? I don't know if it does. Let's see if I can get a stat boost from it. your status effect, okay. As far as I'm aware, you're not psychic. You could have Ice Beam, though.
Ugh, that poison's gonna be annoying. <clears throat> Damn. Rude. Need a Tapraka water type attack. Water absorb. Should be able to take it out with slam. And Blizzard will hurt a bit. Why well, is no news good news? What the fuck? Who the fuck says that? Everybody got a Wii. Alright, well, let's meet Professor Oak. Just a helpful tip.
little fisherman. <laughs> it was like that other dude. I'm tired of fishing. Come fight me. We got pretty high defense, so... Normal discharge should be enough. If we fight a cloister, though... like the difference in level disparity like the level range is just so ugh, drastic here uh, all right I might as well speed through this Corsler can evolve. They don't have an evolution. I had electric fight. What? I'm gonna have to look at the recording and see what the hell she said, because that, that probably that shook me. It looked like she said electrified bikini. I don't know how the hell you would have one of those and not die. What is this? It's probably like an item on that. But I mean, I'm good. Was that a different transition? It kind of looked like a different transition there. Just the one Pokemon discharges enough. He was swimming sideways. Oh, okay. Is this man okay? I will not sleep. So I bested you. Should have woken up on the next turn, but I don't want to take the chance. He technically didn't charge, but I mean a discharge still still wins, so. Okay. Look up. I 
mean, I don't know, man. Only you can answer that question. Yo, I'm so tired of y'all motherfuckers confused right me. So yeah, Volt Absorb, okay. You don't have Volt Absorb. Okay. Wait a minute. Didn't, uh, didn't you have Intimidate? Okay, I haven't seen that proc lately. Hmm. It's kind of weird. Maybe it has proc, and maybe I just didn't notice. Hopefully that's the case. See, logistically speaking, I never understood these swimmers. Was he not psychic type? I thought he was. Really? I missed. Can't miss this. I mean, I can't. But yeah, logistically, I really never understood these swimmers, because it's just like, what are you doing? Are you swimming? Like, realistically, if we live in this world, like, what are you doing? Are you swimming, swimming like, 12 hours, 24 hours a day? Like, why are you just in the ocean? Like, yeah, I see there's rocks keeping y'all from being swept away by the current. Which is, like, a logical explanation for why they haven't been swept away, while also keeping me from going out farther. But, still... You're just swimming for like 12, 24 hours a day, and it's just like, but why? And also, do you not get tired? I see there's land here, so obviously, they'll probably take a break on the bits of land that's around, but at the same time, it's just like, why are you, why are you doing that? Does swimming help your water type Pokemon? If so, that's kind of, I don't know, it feels like too much work, to be honest. Seafoam Island. There's a notice here. We go to the Seafoam Island, Wayne. Oh damn. <coughs> but yeah, just like what? What are you supposed to do with that? You know? Just. Buy a swimming pool that's big enough for you and your Pokemon, your water type Pokemon, because otherwise I just, I don't understand. How are you supposed to, oh, hey, Blue. Alright, little... Alright, I'll remember that. The potion just wore off. <clears throat> yeah, I just did... I, I never understood why they just had swimmers just out here like that. You're not even on the right stream, my man. But I mean, like I said, I, they do have those little islands, so I guess they use those to like take a break. But it should—it just seems too much to me. And three—is she okay? Does she not breathe? Uh, uh, I 
Are we not gonna talk about that? Okay. But in like 3D Pokemon games, it's ever so often you'll see them in the water. Most of the time you'll see them just like standing on the beach, and it's just like I can understand that, you know. Just like, they're not gonna be in the water. Oh, okay. Got worried for a second. I don't know, I guess it's just like a nitpick, just because it doesn't seem like something people would do. Like, I don't know anyone who would just like spend like hours in the ocean. But then again, I don't live in the world of Pokemon, so I don't know. Plus, you get all pruny and shit, and it's just like. I would hate that. I would hate it, actually. I would really get sick of it. Hey! I'm your, I'm your big sister. Learn from this pain. Remember it. <laughs> She's just like, I... Yeah, that's a good mindset. Starly available? I mean, I know it's Gen 4, so technically we can get those Pokemon, but... Is it even available in this area? Skeptical. Alright. Okay. Oof. Got pretty high defense actually so it's not extremely high but it's high enough to warrant you'd rather using a thunder fang than chancing it on the uh a crunch you know so what is this okay so i'm seeing the intimidate proc more so maybe i just didn't uh, notice it Can't even be mad at that. That's kind of hilarious, actually. Okay. Is this the gym? This is the gym. What is this? That's different. Is there anything down here that I could get? Hold on. Because I don't remember the Seafoam Island in the slightest. Oh, Golduck, Psyduck, okay. Get a Seal. Uh -huh. Get a Dugong. Get a Jinx. Oh damn, you can surf and find a slow road. That's actually pretty cool. You can super rod to get a horsey, Seedra, Gyarados, or Kingler. Alright. Since it's a super rod, they're uh, guaranteed level 40. That's actually pretty cool. This is uh, not a... That's so. Okay. Um. Hmm. We'll be, we'll be back. We'll be back. Uh, I gotta see if there's a Pokemon Center around here. I guess not. Okay. Uh. All right. Well. Never mind. Okay, um... What does Blaine even have? 
Magmar, of course I remember that. Uh, Macargo and Rapidash. Wow, he just has three Pokemon. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. Ah, he is asleep. Well, it is a, uh, what's it called? It's a fire type gem. I guess I won't really need him. Will I? Actually, hold on. I should be able to fly away from here, right? Open this unlock now. Uh, let me go ahead and see where it is. It is over there. I'm not exactly sure what I'm supposed to do for this Latios, so mystery. Hey, come on now. Still over here. What level is Latios? I didn't even check to see. Uh. Oh, I didn't go into a Pokemon Center. I was like, why is he hurt? Yeah, I haven't saved in a while. Let me go ahead and save. Yeah, I saved during the glitch, but still. I also do not know what Latias' moveset is. Hello? I'm sorry, I thought I had a fucking <laughs> I thought my character just had a heart attack. I'm sorry. Jesus Christ. Okay, well. Uh, I gotta do the mean look strat again? Come on, man. Is it even worth that? Okay, whatever. I'll catch that on my own time then. While I'm preparing for uh, fighting Red. Man, that means I'll have to... Well, fuck it. You know what? Hold on. So I don't have to waste my time doing this. Jesus Christ, look I was having a heart attack, man. What the fuck? Alright. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, Rapunzel didn't have Quick Claw. Alright, well that was pretty much a full-on waste. I'm not gonna restart again, equip Quick Claw, and just like, I just... I was gonna do that just so I could put it to sleep since I knew it was gonna flee. Excuse me, since I knew it was gonna flee anyway, like the uh, other two legendaries. I was just gonna put it to sleep so that way by the next time I encounter it, it's already asleep. I can just mean look it and we wouldn't have to go through all of that. But since Rapunzel isn't that fast, I'm just not gonna go through that. Uh, where you are? There you are. There you go. All right. All right, Queen. Time for you to get some uh, experience. Oh my God, I can't. Can't fast travel there. I've made a grave error. Oh, I've made a grave error. Okay, well. Uh, shit. Speed it up. it's so annoying that I have to go through and get all the badges then talk to Professor Oak just to get Rock Climb like why couldn't y'all just give that to me after I defeated the uh, Pokemon League why do you have to stiff arm me so I have to be all fucking 16 Pokemon uh, gym leaders for me to be able to do that like that's just so dumb You know, I got rid of strength, didn't I? On you? Yeah, I did. What in the world? <laughs> Pretty decent levels. Yeah, of course I get hit when they intimidate. That's fine. Earth power. Oh. I mean, you did use uh, intimidate, so I guess that's why. But still, that's impressive. I was about to say, you're gonna try extreme speed. He did fairly well. He did fairly well. Just weird. Weird dialogue. go either way I don't know the difference between that I feel like it has something to do with the tiles I don't know I'm fine with fighting everybody if I have to so Tails, okay. Yeah, let's go ahead and speed that back up. Mm. 
Uh. You take a step backwards. Okay. I get it. So he was there to basically teach you that. Can I change the direction you stepped in? Is that what they trying to tell me? I don't know if that's what they were trying to tell me. I mean, I'm gonna try it. Nice, 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 okay. So if I talk to you from here, would you take a step back up there? Let's see how good this earth power is. Uh, no, just cause you fucking with me. Damn. Okay, so I can't influence the way that they move back. Also, what is the difference between earth power and earthquake is it like a difference of 20 base power i know this is 100 what is their power power is 90 okay you have yeah that's right it's it's a little tight i don't know the fact that it can potentially lower The uh, opponent's special defense is kind of what keeps me to use it, so. Okay, that's weird. Not gonna lie to you. Nice, good job, Queen. That was a good crit. Honest God, did not realize I still had a, uh, what's it called? I didn't realize I still had a repel on. This kind of works out. Earth power, go ahead. Let's say at least do half damage. Ooh, saucy. Superpower? Huh. What is the bot? There's a drawback from that, right? Lowers the attack and defense. Yeah, it's not worth it. Because I don't have any one... I could... No. I was about to say, I could use that against the Snorlax or the Macho uh, that Blue has, but no, it's not really worth all that. Uh, you can stay in and then switch out with Slappy after this. If that crits, that might actually be dangerous. Okay, crit definitely would have been dangerous. Special attack fell, but that's still fucking, that's still dangerous. Even if the special attack fell, it still did over half, uh, half my health without even critting, so. Overheat. Switching was definitely necessary. 
You are four times ineffective. I should not be scared. Go ahead, hold this surf for me. Why? Why does everyone fucking know Confuse Ray and Johto? What the hell is up with that? Slappy, please. Slappy, please. My boy Slappy, uh... Excuse me, my girl Slappy has a, has a bad history of uh, getting hit in the face. I mean, I know that's your strongest fire type move, but I don't know if that was the right decision. Because now you're hurt by recoil. I believe in you, Slappy. I'm sorry. My belief uh, apparently hurt you. Let's go ahead and just use a full restore. I don't feel like dealing with Confused Ray, to be honest, so we're just gonna go ahead and get rid of that. What? Does that bounce? That is bounce. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Okay, I was about to say. Come on. Never in my life have I been so insulted. Yeah, I knew you were gonna do that, so it was no point in me trying to... I missed. Missed a paralyzed Pokemon. What are you? What are you, a scrub? Uh, I wish I wish Surf could hit from that. Also, Slappy is basically saying "fuck your paralysis." No, like Slappy for real said "fuck your paralysis." I guess because she's a ground type, but still, that's just like damn. She can give a single fuck. Ah, come on. Slight drawback, sure. <laughs> I look forward to it. Who the fuck is Todd? Okay, whatever. Hmm. Alright. Alright. Now we just need to fight blue. And then we'll finish the Nuzlocke out with red. I'm in a good spot to fight red, to be honest. Uh, some of his Pokemon are going to be higher level than some of mine. Uh, but that's fine. I've made the preparations I need. Uh, excuse me. The battle with blue will have some Pokemon at higher level than mine. Red will definitely have higher level Pokemon. But I'm making preparations for that. And honestly, I should be good to go once I get to that. So, let's hope. Anyway. Um, we're going to end it for now. I'm gonna check and see. Yeah, I, uh, I real. <sighs> Excuse me. When I searched the Seafoam Islands to see if there was anything worth catching, apparently you can encounter Articuno here. So, well, I'm gonna do that in my spare time. See if I can, uh, you know, get get that as a catch. Hmm. I don't quite know. I 
quite know how I get down to him. I guess he's at the bottom. Maybe he's at the bottom. I gotta look it up. But I'll do that in my spare time. And maybe I'll try to catch Latios in my spare time too. So, yeah. Uh, but next time, uh, we'll be right in front of Viridian Jim. Ready to challenge Blue. And once we beat him, we're gonna head straight to Red. Over in Mount Silver. Maybe we'll stop by the dragon then, see what our rival's doing, I don't know, we'll see. But yeah, for now at least, uh, let's save. And we're almost at the end of this Nuzlocke, it has been a long one. Yeah, had some deaths, but overall I think we're gonna come out on top for this last fight. But. We'll see you in the next session. So, till then, see you guys later.